Hi, Phil Lindsay here with Pete Magazine. We're here at the Stadium of Light ahead of the Summer Rumble number seven and making his peep debut. We've got Troy Williamson, 3 0, oh, two knockouts. Nice to get you first on camera. Yeah, yeah. So, your, who was it you're fighting again? Uh, Alistair Warren. Alistair Warren, that's right. Yeah. Which for fourth fight, I mean, normally when people are fighting Alistair Warren, I think you've often fought him in his fifth or sixth fight. Um, most guys who fight Alistair Warren, it's normally people who've had a few more fights. Yeah. yeah. He's a tough kid, like you said, to have for me to step up for my fourth fight, but I'm ready and uh, I've trained hard and I'm going to put a show on. And obviously, you haven't really put a foot wrong in your yeah. career so far. Obviously, getting two stoppages in the three fights, but it's not just getting those two stoppages, it's, it's the way that you've been doing it as well. So, what's your plans moving forward? Obviously, with it being your peep debut, yeah. I haven't had been asking a lot of background questions and things like that. So, what's what's your background with boxing? Obviously, you've had three pro fights. Yeah, well, uh, I had, uh, had quite a big amateur. Uh, I've got a good amateur pedigree. Yeah. Um, boxed for Great Britain and uh, went in numerous tournaments from there. Won a few gold medals and then obviously turned professional. I'm signed with Frank Warren. Yeah. Managed by MTK. My bad, yeah. Um, Not MGM. MTK. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna see big things for me. And I know it's 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 very. I always hark back to the Ricky Hatton interview at the very start of his career when they were saying, "Okay, how far are you gonna go?" And he's like, oh, "I want to be a world champion." And yeah, yeah. He, he proved that to be the case, and he probably had a similar amateur background to yourself and that sort of thing in terms of the preparation for that. But in terms of the pro career, what are your ultimate ambitions? Uh, I am Ricky Hatton. I have put like completely different style. Oh yeah. Uh, so I just, just mean in terms of the amateur background. Yeah, um, yeah, he's done great Ricky Hatton as a professional as well. So hopefully just. If I could do half as what he's done, I'd be a happy man, but we're obviously looking to go bigger and better things. Absolutely. But first time out, so first things first, you've obviously got the July 16th fight. Yeah, yeah. And obviously, signed with Frank Warren. Obviously, we're going to be having some, hopefully, some BT sports shows up here later in the year as well. Will you be looking to be getting them as well? Yeah, definitely. Obviously, just I go away first of September on all day, so hopefully it falls in October. And I'll be on that show. Brilliant. Well, well, I suppose if you're going away on the first of September, it's, it's not a three-day break, is it? A proper holiday? Uh, all day, yeah. Uh, well, if anybody earns a, a holiday, it's a boxer. But uh, anyway, Troy. Yeah. All the best on the thing. Are you, are you still got tickets left? Yeah, I've got tickets. Yeah. How can people get in touch with you to get tickets off uh, you? They can get me on Facebook, obviously, like you say, Instagram, Twitter, and obviously my phone number. It's uh, 07496 555 We don't want any stalking of any girls out there, okay? Try Williamson, all the best to make it 4 0. Thanks very much, man. Cheers, man.